How's it going everybody? This is Sanak here, welcoming you back for another episode of my Pokemon Leaf Green Randomizer, Nuzlocke. If you're new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button, like the video, and hit the shell bell to stay notified whenever I upload. Um, in the last episode, we got here to Cinnabar Island, and we took care of the Pokemon Mansion as well as Blaine's Gym. Um, and I also noticed that I had forgotten that Sabrina was a gym leader here, apparently. So that's what we're going to go ahead and do in today's episode. Uh, we're going to go Saffron and we're going to just go straight to Sabrina. We're not going to try to tackle as many of the trainers as in her gym as possible. Because uh, off screen, I did handle a lot e of the grinding a little bit. Uh, EJ was like 20 some and so was James underscore EXE. Uh, which, and, uh, speaking of James, he got Moonlight off screen as well. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and actually evolve our Gloom to a beautiful Vile Bloom. So let's go ahead and just do that already. Because honestly, the next move that he gets is Petal Dance which is a very good grass move and it can learn it as a vile plume already and there would be no reason to kind of hold off until level 44 so why not we get a stronger pokemon while we're at it and look at that very very beautiful vile plume is a really good pokemon i'm actually really excited to use it and see that it's fully evolved so james you're at your full potential now so i love it um so cool the move the moves that James has now, uh, the only thing that changed was I got rid of Cut for Moonlight. So we don't have to use it for a while. And besides, I'll use like an HM Slave if I ever need to. And that's basically it. So enough with the team. Let's just go ahead and tackle Sabrina. And in this episode, I'm going to kind of tackle, uh, depending how fast Sabrina goes, if she goes kind of quick, um, I will end up uh, doing the Sevi Islands a little bit in this episode as well too. So I always forget the order, so you're probably going to see me shuffle around a bit. As far as I remember, the more, not the more bottom left that we go, but usually bottom left is kind of the way to go, if I'm not mistaking. Yeah, so if you hit the corner of that room right here with the... Well, not that one. I think there's one over. I don't know what room it was. But we got to Sabrina already, so yeah, very nice. Uh, I actually feel ready. Her team should not be too bad. It's like kind of on par with Koga, where the ace is like level 43. And as you saw in the last episode, we already took care of Blaine, so I'm not too worried. I watch her have a legendary now. So I didn't see what type of Pokemon that the trainers have, so let's go ahead and see. I had a vision of your arrival. I had psychic power since I was a child. It started when a spoon I carelessly tossed bent. I dislike battling, but if you wish, I show you my powers. So she tossed it and it bent. So, and she said she has psychic powers, but yeah, no, she really does. <laughs> so leader Sabrina would like to battle. Oh, that's, an, that's a ho-ho. That is fun, okay. EJ can use thunder for that. That's not too bad, but it's still kind of scary. So she's either going to be uh, a fire trainer or a flying trainer and i'm gonna place my bets on being a fire trainer because that's interesting and cool ej hit both thunders what's a legendary right thank you ej i'm so happy that we actually ended up going and get thunder for him okay so she's a flying trainer so i'm just gonna send out kepson because it's four times weak to ice, so that's gonna be very useful. Very nice. I, like, I mean, we should probably breeze through this one as why I was thinking that we'll probably do the Sevi Islands and everything too. And I kind of feel bad that a gym leader will be kind of put into a minus, minuscule part of the video. <laughs> that's why I'm probably gonna title the episode, Sabrina Who? <laughs> I mean, you'll see whenever this goes up. Another Gligar? Yo, that's wasted potential. Okay. Nothing, man. These gym leaders need to really put up a challenge. And if I'm not mistaking, Drew put every Pokemon to evolve at level 40 fully. So I think... Oh, I'll tear you. I'll keep out Kepsin again. Um, anything over 40 will be fully evolved. So that way, I believe... Well, no, because then... 
What's his face? Blaine had uh, Dratini at 47. Never mind. Just. Uh, I hope the last gym leader is not like this, unfortunately, because I really, really want to challenge in these, and I don't want to just breeze through it as we just did. So, you know. GG, Sabrina. You lost already. Kind of like Blaine. Oh, this loss shocks me, but a loss is a loss. I admit, I didn't work hard enough to win. Your victory has earned the Marsh Badge. And with that, I want to go ahead and add that to the layout, please. Future me, thank you. Pokemon up to level 70. Okay, so blah, 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 blah. Weep, 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 weep. If I'm not mistaken, this is Calm Mind. Because again, uh, unfortunately, me telling Drew not to randomize these things, uh, or failing to do so, it's going to be Calm Mind. That's not bad, though. Calm Mind's a good TM. That's not bad. Okay, so that happened. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and, yeah, as you saw, I taught, if I'm not mistaken, I went right here. I might be a little bit. Oh, never mind. Woo! <laughs> Man, I, like, I was super worried that that was gonna last forever, but Hey, we breezed through Sabrina, and as I promised, we're gonna go ahead and take care of the Sevi Islands and everything too. Because, uh, again, thank you all so much for voting on uh, the Twitter poll and everything in the last episode that I had posted. Um, I know that I had asked if you guys would rather if I went to the gym, the eighth gym already, or to uh, to the Sevi Islands, and you all voted for the Sevi Islands, which was probably one vote, by the way. Uh, so it was very, very close. But the Sevi Island, let's go ahead and go to one island already. Because uh, they said that it was probably better that we get the encounters. And then obviously I was going to do them at one point for the legends. Because I know they moved Moltres over here to, what to uh, I believe, one island. If I'm not mistaken. But yeah, no, they, they took care of that. And then so I was going to go ahead and grab some more encounters. And a little bit of training too. So that's kind of going to be, that's going to be beneficial for this too. Here we are, this is one island. Several islands around here, and this is one of them. My friend Celio sent the boat to fetch me here. He's in charge. Okay, so why am I telling you this now? Let's go. I <laughs> love the speed up button. Celio, okay. So this is not really important, so I'm gonna just kinda sum everything up because in these games, this is uh, completely optional because this was a brand new thing that they added compared to red and blue. So I thought it was pretty cool that they kind of Oh, let's just skip the fast travel or whatever. Meteorite. Try pass so we can go to the one, two, and three islands. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to take care of some of, mainly a lot of the things in, um, on this one. If not, probably all of it. Because it might be a little bit of a longer video, but again, the one, two, three island right now is all optional. And we could have skipped it. So I'm gonna take, take care of it in this episode. So a little bit of treat to you guys. Give you guys a little bit of a longer episode, but why not? We got Kindle Road here and one island. Okay, so we got Kindle Road. I want to put up a repel because I would like to actually get the encounter from the grass. Do I have more repel? Okay, that's super repel, so just not bad. Okay. Oh, do I have Pokeballs first off? It's been a while. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, Pokeballs. 24. Yeah, we should be fine. I got 30 Ultra Balls and stuff, too. Um, and I'm also kind of noticing that... Well, not noticing, but... Uh, just so y'all know, I am back to using my webcam because I've been having a little bit of tech issues recently. Okay, so what's, what's our encounter, actually? Hold on. Oh, that sounds like a Gen 3 mod. Is that Shidin? No, not Shidinja. Ninja? No, Shedinja. I think that's Shedinja. Yo, Shedinja. That's not bad, but... Wonder Guard, though. Hello? Okay, so we can't do anything to it. So, James. Come on out. Confuse Ray. That's an interesting Pokemon, though. Okay, we're gonna put it to sleep because we cannot weaken it because it only has one HP. Um, if you guys have, if you guys are very familiar, this is one Pokemon that has Wonder Guard. Um, oh, what's its catch rate? Because that's probably going to be a little hard to catch. Okay. Okay, 
while this is going, I'm gonna throw up a um, to see what beautiful subscriber we can name this after. So forgive me if I'm looking down real quick, and I'm going to throw some Pokeballs meanwhile. Okay. Uh, Arg. Catch it. Very nice. Okay. So I believe we got one person who I'd like to name this after. Um, let me see. I would love to name this after... After... You commented recently, there you are. Okay. I would love to name this after Orpheus, because you're a very new subscriber. And again, I appreciate the support if you are watching this. So Orpheus, thank you so much for being a beautiful Sanok squad member. And make sure, let me see if I can spell this properly. Don't want to end up with another meta meta issue. <laughs> Orpheus. Okay. So welcome to the Sanok squad, Orpheus. I hope you enjoy the Pokemon. Um, okay, so I believe that's what we can do here. I think we don't we don't need to do anything here in one island So I'm just gonna fly right back over there and Go to two island because that's what we need to do in this episode is that we need to take the meteorite that Celio gave to us So we can give it to one of his friends uh, No, I think it's three island If I'm not mistaken Is it three island or two? Island? Oh, okay. Oopsies. Okay, let me see. Okay, yeah, it is this island. So what we're gonna do, uh, while we're here, there's another encounter we can get here, Cape Brink. So let's see what we can catch. Okay, what is this going to be? That sounds like Kecleon. Yo, that's a Kecleon. And if I was smart enough at the fighting dojo to have taken this one instead of the ferret, I could have dupes here. But my own mistakes made me do this. Okay, so fighting type now. We get to oh hello. Okay, calm down, calm down. Okay, James, come on out, please. Uh, sleep powder. Very nice. Great ball. One. Yeah, one Pokeball. Very nice. Very very nice. I love catching these Pokemon very quick. Who do we have after a Kecleon? Cool. I would like to name this after Tyler. So Tyler a bit, has been a recent, not a recent, but she uh, been a, a subscriber as well. If I can English today. <laughs> um, huge supporter, especially with the Soul Link and everything with Beegers. It's been a very, very, very big support. So thank you so much, Tyler for showing the amazing support and welcome to the Sanok squad on my Nuzlocke. Uh, do I even have a starter? I don't have one because here you can actually learn uh, blast burn or those like hyper beam moves depending like for fire, water and grass. Okay. So we can't do anything here. Fly back over here, heal up. Very nice, very nice. Okay. And I think you only sell Okay, so you, you sell more Great Balls and stuff. 28. Why not? Grab some more Pokeballs and stuff. You can never be too prepared. Legends are everywhere. <laughs> so let's go ahead and talk to the dude here. Uh, now, where's Lost Doll getting to today? She's always bringing me lunch every day by now. Oh, you there. You're a friend of Lost Dell's? Have you seen Lost Doll around? I don't know where she might be. She's been here long ago. Lostel's a cutie. She's got my looks. Yo, you're a bald guy. Coming from another bald guy. <laughs> eh, what is this game corner? How much sadder can this get? Those clowns. They said they'd be waiting here on this island, so where are they? Hey, you, this is only three island. Wait, is this the only three island around here? Try waking up before you crawl out of bed, you punk. This is two island. Okay, blah, blah, blah. Just kind of dumb story. Um, yeah, so scuffed up my floors. Okay, so, but listen, I'm begging you, go to Three Island, and if you happen to find my Lost O, my place is the house with the red roof in Three Island. Okay. So we gotta go to Three Island and help him find his child, because apparently they work and live on two different islands, because, you know, Pokemon logic, or, I don't know, <laughs> what other logic could be. Uh, did I hit one island? Yeah, I hit one island. 
That is a very fast boat, by the way. <laughs> okay, so I think you guys fork, o fork over some spending money. Aye! Okay, so I think this is also another encounter. I could be wrong. No. I am extremely wrong here. Okay, yeah, because I think he sits there and like builds all the way through to a different island once you finish the main game. I haven't focused too much on the Savvy Island stuff, so... So, let me go ahead and heal up, because we're here for a couple battles. I will actually get an HM Slave, by the way, because we're gonna go to the Lost Forest, and we're gonna need Cut to get some items and stuff too, so... Why don't we put... I'm gonna put Kepsen away. Wait, no, I'm gonna keep Kepsen just for Surf. Um... This is always hard. I'm gonna put Lanak away for a little bit. So I can just have someone who can use Cut. Um, who's going to be? Why not? Lucario, you amazing person, you. I'm gonna use you. <laughs> so, welcome to the team momentarily. Um, okay, so you got full... Okay, I don't know why it didn't matter. Okay, so we're gonna rock with that for a little bit. So, welcome in, Lucario. The layout won't change because you're not a permanent change, but... Just got here, pal, with those hostile attitudes. Mighty cold of you. Gang followers, blah, 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 you know. Um, you, what are you staring at? Don't, it's, do you know it's not polite? You want to make something of it or what? Uh, yeah, bud. Face me. Um, losing lunch money? Um, I could go for some food right now. <laughs> biker goon. I don't know if his name is goon or they just literally put biker goon. So, yo, 37 Lapras gone. This is why I love having thunder and everything. Yo, wall rain? Kepsen, you're gonna evolve into that. I think one more level, if I'm not mistaking. Which would be pretty cool. Oh man, don't you dare laugh. Aren't you from Kando? You should be on our side. Just because we're on different islands doesn't mean we should divide and conquer guys. <laughs> Lessons with Sanat. Okay. Double kick again. Because these battles are just kind of pointless, in my opinion. I don't know why they introduced these dumb little things. Um, I mean, I get the whole island system. I love the whole island system thing, but the biker goon thing, I don't know why, to be completely honest, but, you know, extra story doesn't hurt or extra th things. Yo, pin missile, I will gladly get rid of sand attack because I know I'm not going to be really using it too much. It probably would help me, but eh. I'd rather offense than status. I'm telling you, you gotta do something about this kid. I've been watching you. I'd say you'd done enough. What are you, their friends or something? I guess they'll be battling me in their place. I mean, you could have stepped in earlier if you're penalty, you're the boss. Cue ball, Paxton. Um, that's why we got pin missile. Eh, it's not gonna do too much. Urgh, double team was disgusting. Okay, but we didn't miss, which was great. Sableye, okay. Very simple Pokemon. Thunder. Huh, yeah. Go right on hanging around with these hayseeds. Is that an insult? You guys are a bunch of hayseeds. <laughs> Why would that be an insult? Okay, so with that, we're gonna go ahead and continue on and head over to the Lost. Thank you, those goons. Cool, we got a full restore. So if you guys are playing any of these games, make sure you talk to them after you're done. Because, you know, sometimes they might give you a little bit of gifts. Went to Bond Bridge. Okay. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, there's also... Yeah, there's an item over here, but we need cut. Okay, thank you. Very nice. Zinc. Okay, we can sell that for a little bit more money. Even though I'm not hurting for money, um, you know, it doesn't hurt. <laughs> So Bond Bridge, and there's another place to cut here. But I think this one's a hidden item. Okay, a PP up. Very nice. Stop it! Okay. The trees in Kanto grow pretty quick, or in Pokemon in general, they grow pretty quick. We can avoid that double battle right there, but I think we are going to have to fight this lady here. 
after... Oh, was this an encounter? <gasps> I didn't pay attention. Yo, I think this is an encounter. Okay. I will see, and if it's not, I will definitely get rid of it, obviously. But this is an encounter. Okay, so we have gold pin. Amnesia. Okay, you're fine. You're fine. Uh, I just... Why did I do that? Okay. EJ, come out again. Quick attack. Yo, you're just gonna quit. Oh, was that toxic? Yo, that was toxic. Okay, so I gotta be very careful with this. Your special defense is rising. You crazy little monster, you. Okay, so I'm gonna send out James again because it can resist all these things that it's gonna be doing. Thank you. And just gonna throw some Pokeballs. Um, Gulpin's not bad. It's going to be more of a special defensive wall, I believe is what it's made up. <laughs> <laughs> made up of so cool um i know it's not a pikachu but i want to go ahead and name this after captures because you have been sub uh, subscribed and an amazing supporter as well uh you haven't been commenting much but you know I don't, i'm not asking for people to do it too often but this is what an incentive you guys do <laughs> shameless plug but captures thank you so much for leaving your comment down in the recent Soul Link episode, and for being a fantastic Sanok Squad member. So, welcome to the party. Well, to the squad. I have a full box, and I'm surprised. I didn't think I was actually going to have a full box on in, in this Lock, to be completely honest. Okay, so I know EJ is poisoned, but we're gonna get there really quick and make sure he doesn't faint. We got 75 steps. Because was this a different encounter? Three Island, <laughs> Bond Bridge. Yeah, okay. So I need to quit full around. Okay, very nice. Whee! Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Very nice. Okay. So we're going to head back. I, I know we're going to have to battle that lady. And I think there's a hidden item right over... Oh, oh Stantler. Okay, so I think I would have taken the, uh, the... Dude, the same grass? Okay. So I think I would have rather taken the uh, Drowsy. That would have been nice. But oh well, you know, how Nuzlocke's go. Hey, feel. Yo, it's Kepson again. Hello, Kepson. Okay, so what do you got, lady? Latias. Okay, so that, that's the thing I noticed about this Nuzlocke. The non-important trainers are the ones that give me the most trouble, and they have the scary mons. And I do not understand that. Yo, calm down. I don't want to risk it. I, as much as I want to just risk it, but... Oh, special attack bell. Okay, that's fine. We got it. Is this another Latias? A Dragonite. Yo, calm down. Kepsen, come on out. I think it's another, okay, it's another Dragonite. Huh. Of course you paralyzed. Very nice, 42. It, are you gonna evolve here? I think you evolve at this level. Oh, you don't. I think I might... Is it 43 or is it 47? I don't think, oh, Porygon 2 would have been nice. Yo, but it's all right. Let's go ahead and heal up again because I ain't playing no games. <laughs> this is gonna be the episode of just running back and forth to the Pokemon Center. Okay. Very nice. Teddy Ursa? Yo, and it's at, it's at evolution range as well. So that would have been cool too. An Ursa ring would have been fantastic. Okay, so we're gonna skip you because I know we can't get any encounters in the water or anything. I'm just gonna go this way. Excuse me, lady. Almost got caught. Cool, so we got another encounter here at Berry Forest. Um, I don't know if would the Hypno encounter count? Okay, so this is the encounter anyway. I didn't hear that. Yo, that's a Snorlax. <gasps> that's not bad, but at the same time, its catch rate is abysmal. Okay, so that's fine. I'm gonna keep doing that. You're gonna rest. Oh, I hate you. 
Oh, but you're gonna be. Oh, yo, calm down. Okay, Drac. I need you out here. <laughs> okay, we can't be having that out here. Okay, that's fine. Ugh. Okay, so I'm gonna Ultra Ball. Oh, I almost clicked Master Ball. What? As soon as I said the catch. Okay, wh whatever. <laughs> yo. The game makes a liar out of me. Okay. So, you're a recent subscriber. Why not? So, I'm going to go ahead and name this after Make It Totter. But I'm going to just nickname it Totter. Because that sounds like a perfect nickname for uh, a Snorlax. I don't know why. Because for me, I like to name my... Uh, if Shameless plug to my vanilla Let's Play of Leaf Green. I nickname my Snorlax on my team uh, Totoro. So... Fans of Studio Ghibli, unite! <laughs> cool. So we're going to go ahead and skip a lot. Um, for those of you guys who have never played uh, the remakes, which I kind of doubt that y'all haven't or not, but the since they introduced berries in this game, this is where in Fire Red and Leaf Green you would be able to come get them constantly because once a day, uh, they refresh, I believe. Yo, Crobat would have been cool. Um, I'm actually just gonna full restore DJ. Yeah, because since there's no berry trees in in these remakes because of you know they weren't introduced in there, um, this is how they implemented it. So it was pretty cool. I like that they took the thought of keeping up with like the mechanics and everything for uh, for the different remakes and stuff. So that's pretty cool. Full heal, full heal. Okay, very nice. Can we keep going? Skip that. Any more berries? Not there, at least. I believe there's just one section of this place that's kind of annoying where you have to cut like five trees, I believe. So let's go ahead and see if we can. Yo, Magneton would have been a cool one too. Shout out to the Soul Link. <laughs> so many Pokemon that I'm seeing from there here. Petcha Berry is nice. Yeah, there's the tree part. Venonat would have been bad. Cool. Okay, it's four trees. I'm lying. It's not five. Okay, so I don't know. Would the Hypno uh, battle be static to you guys? I'm going to catch that anyway. Um, just depending if it, depending if it's dupes or not. Just I want you guys to let me know. That will be the comment question of the day. Is the Hypno in Berry Forest a static or just a part of the Berry Forest encounters? Cause I know that it's a it's a mandatory battle, so excuse me, little girl. I'm gonna check for berries first before I rescue you. Haha. <laughs> okay. A little whimper sniff. <laughs> whimper sniff. I love that. Like for them to like show the actions and stuff, they have to type it out. That's hilarious. Um. Okay. Wah, I want my daddy. Okay. So what Pokemon is this? Yo, is that Cray Dilly? Yo, that's Cray Dilly. Um, I'm going to catch it. And then, like I said, in the comments below, let me know if you all think that this is the uh, a static encounter, or is this going to be part of the uh, Berry Forest encounters? So I would love to hear y'all's thoughts. I would like to consider this a static because it is mandatory. Oh, please don't. So, I mean, again, like, I, I'd like to hear y'all's thoughts on this. Mm. This is not gonna catch. I don't like this. Quick attack. Oh, quick confusing. Oh, I killed it anyway. Yay! Hooray! So, whatever. <laughs> it could have been a... I, I guarantee you guys were going to say that it was a static, so I'm heartbroken a little bit. How can I thank you? Lost El Darling, forgive me. Daddy didn't know you were scared and in trouble. It's okay, Daddy. I got my friend with the knack. Yo, join the Sanok Squad. Subscribe now. Hashtag Sanok Squad. No. <laughs> Shameless plug. Cool. So, oh, let me actually talk to the dude. What's that? You're saying that you got this for me? How did you know I love rare rocks and gems? Well, we didn't know. We got forced into this. <laughs> from Bill, so you have to thank him for me. Okay. 
You know, you've been fantastic. I want you to have this. So we got a Moonstone, even though that's... Um, we had a couple of them already, so... Not too bad, but not too great either. So what we're going to do is that we're going to finish up the... Uh, we're going to finish up here at the Sevi Islands, or the 1, 2, 8, 3 Islands, and just talk to Bill and everything and get that set up. Because I believe they're already finished. What kept you so long? It's been been out having a good time? We got it done. The PC is up and running. The job went incredibly quick. Bill is one amazing guy. Oh no. <laughs> Modest rich guy talk. <laughs> cool. So we're going to head back and I believe... Woo! <laughs> hey, wasn't that a long cruise? No, it wasn't. My buddy Celio seemed to enjoy your company. I'm sure he'd welcome you back if you visit him again. If you have their tripass, you can always take a ferry there from Vermilion Port. Okay. Thank you for your company. And then he just walks on water away. Bye. <laughs> cool. So with that, guys, um, I'm going to go ahead and heal up real quick. And then I believe I'm going to go ahead and... Well, I'm going to have to call it an episode because, yeah, that's... We took care of a lot of things, actually, which is pretty cool. I, I didn't think... I thought this was going to take forever, but... Thank you guys so much for watching. I know this was a little bit of a longer episode, but again, um, Sabrina was pretty quick. Uh, I wanted to make a little quick work of her, unfortunately, because I did skip her and I did train up a little bit, so we were kind of on par. But, um, and then the one, two, one to three islands were uh, optional, so I wanted to make sure that I at least got the encounters there and take care of everything there while we could. So I think what we're going to go ahead and do is I'm going to end the episode here, obviously. And I want to thank you all so much for watching. And in the next episode, I think we're probably going to go ahead and take on the 8th gym. Because why not? We're already here. We're very close to the end. And I, it, it's sad to tell me. I mean, it's sad that it's almost over. But I'm having a blast. I hope you guys are as well. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and get up out of here. And with that, guys, I'll see you guys in the next episode.